All right, Abby, 4-0 win against Clinton tonight. Um, after Elena's first goal, you know, right away in that first half, um, it seemed like it could be a game where the girls could break it open quickly. Um, what, what, what do you think kind of uh, transpired the rest of that first half where uh, Elena's goal remained the difference after 40 minutes? Um, we were just having trouble scoring. We were getting the opportunities up there and we were getting the ball up there. We just we couldn't quite get it in. So I think it was mainly just an inability to score, not really an attitude that was our issue. An ability to set up the score and just uh, kind of missing out on the finish a couple of times. Yeah, we were going over to the side or just we were a little off. So uh, mu do you feel like there was much change from the first half to the second half? What was uh, Coach Esper kind of telling the girls in, in, the, in the huddle at halftime? Um, he wanted, I mean, oh, he always wants us to always pick it up a little bit and he wanted us to work on trying to get it in and he really wanted us to um, work on getting our crosses and so we could have more opportunities to score from closer up so it'd be harder for us to miss. And then uh, a, a, a familiar face uh, back on the field in Lily, uh, you know, kind of being able to get back uh, to, to a healthy state where she can be out front there. Um, what does it mean to have a girl like Lily out there on the on the attack? To uh, d does it just you know just another option you know kind of in the in the arsenal really? Um, it kind of reminds me of when Raina came back. It's just really nice to have the outside player back, be able to cross it in. And uh, yeah, uh, Regina on Friday. Um, you know, what are you and the girls kind of looking forward to to uh, uh, to, to get another win there? Um, we're just we're gonna work really hard. All of this is preparing for a sub state so that we're ready to go and we're just trying to get our energy up and get our mojo back.